So we are at Madge's Croft today. I'm currently fishing for the Eid because it's been a slow morning. I had a bit of a plan to fish up and down the slope just looking for fish because I fished a match here two, three weeks ago. I just dropped my mags everywhere and I definitely could have done a couple things differently. But I mean, I turned up with a plan and it's actually the complete opposite that's working today. But the eyes are absolutely on fire. I'm fishing with that super shallow rig. It's probably only about 10 inches maximum. And I mean, when the eyes are hitting it, I'm getting them pretty much every time. But it's more or less a case of maggots out, laying the rig on the top, and just waiting for it to go. But once it's hit straight in the water, I have to just lay it back down again and let them take it on the drop. I was fishing with a deeper rig. Oh, there we go. But then I actually tangled and I couldn't fix it. So I had kind of been forced to fish with a shallower rig and it actually worked out reasonably nice. So I'm not going to complain. Fishing with a super light elastic, just a little nine dura slip and a little point one float. So super light, strung out shot. And I mean, I'm not going to complain. I could sit and catch those most of the day and I'm not bothered. The wind was meant to be much higher than this. It was meant to be like 13, 14 mile an hour, but it's actually ended up being like no wind at all, which is lovely. So I'm just fishing with a single white maggot on a size 16 hook. I'm getting my maggots, pinging them out to about 12, 13 metres. I'm having to ship out reasonably slow because I don't fancy tangling this rig up. I mean, it's almost four o'clock now, so I kind of hope the eye would turn on about this time. It's five o'clock. Can't be five o'clock. It was only three o'clock ten minutes ago. I think he's probably read it as 15. I mean, the fish have turned on for me, mate. I'm catching loads of them, it's great. <laughs> nah, you'll get one. My little brother's down there, fishing tight to the island with our method feeder, because he's only eight, he can't fish with a pole. But I mean, I'm catching these plenty, it's great. Maggots everywhere. There we go. Just to put in the feed out two or three catapults. Them hearing the maggots dropping and then they're coming back straight back into it. And I think the majority of the time, it's resulting in pretty quick bites. I could have swung him into hand, but my rig's so shallow. Trying to play them under the under the water because I lose them more and they flap about on the top.
Oh, he was barely hooked. Yeah, and keeping a tight line just so that the fish practically hooks itself against my elastic. There we go. I mean, you'd be more than happy with a day's fishing like this on a pleasure session. And I think you'd be more than happy enough with a day's fishing like this in a match. the average stamp they're probably about so I wouldn't complain getting the maggots through the bahuki getting back here I'm my hands on because I don't like shipping out with wet hands. It's not very nice. Good yeah? I you caught a bream? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cheese. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, putting that little bit more feed out is just obviously spurring them on when it gets quiet. But then. Obviously, I'm not pushing out as far as I have been before, so... It's just kind of showing that they are everywhere in front of me in my peg right now. There we go again. I'm not struggling to catch them. Which is nice, because it makes for an easy day's fishing. And it makes for a good day's filming. I mean, I don't like filming when I'm not catching anything. I mean, this little bump bar in front of me is great. I was using it this morning because I was fishing out at 14 metres. But obviously, I do not need to be out at 14 metres if I'm barely hitting 12. Likewise, I think I fished a match. Not yesterday, but the day before, I fished the SF, the SFCA cup, and it just showed me I need to feed. I'm so reluctant to put in bait. I'm, I'm a really negative angler all times of the year, so I don't really like to feed very much, which is a bad habit. I really need to get out of that habit because, I mean, in the last hour, I fed two pints of maggots. To be honest, I probably could have fed about three, but I've just dropped them all over me as well. Lovely. I mean, there's probably half the maggots on the floor. But if I can just keep them going, I'm only going to be here for like another half an hour. Because I've got to go soon. It's coming up for tea time. Wait and see if anything happens. There we go. Just put more maggots in. Get the catapult out. And bring this boy in. I've got to, I've got to keep my feet going because I think it's showing if I don't, it dies off. He's a bit of a smaller one as well, so... For me, yeah. I'd say so, yeah. And that's only been in the last kind of two hours. Yeah, just seeing 20, 30 pound of fish in the last two hours-ish. It's not bad. I mean, it's speed fishing. You've got to be really efficient, which is something I'm really trying to work on. Because I get really caught up. I get really frustrated. And I've got to... I've got to have more of a routine about it. 